Hey guys, so I got my new GoPro in. I decided to take a little video real quick. My son and I were working on the KFX 450R. And we mounted this sick bumper. I have not wired in the uh, light bar that came with it yet. Just got it this afternoon. Looks pretty good, I think. Put a carb kit in the KLX 650. And now it starts in a couple of kicks. I need to look into the front brake caliper. It was sticking earlier this week. And this right here is another new toy that you guys haven't seen yet. It is a 2009 Kawasaki KX450F. Fuel injected. I got it from the original owner. Got a title with it. It had 64 hours on it whenever I got it. I don't know if you can see it now. It has 69 hours on it now. Oh, yes, I left it at 69 on purpose and stopped writing. This is what I hurt my knee on the other day doing wheelies. It's got an FMF PowerCore 4 slip-on exhaust. And all of the suspension has been totally redone. Um, it's got a gripper seat. I put on Pro Taper clamp on handles, grips, I uh, put on an ODI, I guess they call that a crash pad. This thing rips. I will take some action videos of it later on. Basically just wanted to try out the new camera and show you guys what's going on. I got a confirmation on the exhaust for this, the Dasa exhaust. It should be here tomorrow. I'm supposed to go out of town this weekend to do a field service, so I don't know if I'll get it on in time. This is the motor for the turd. Haven't been working on it because I've been playing with these toys. Uh, my Polaris is at the mechanic right now. These are the sand tires that came with my KFX. There's really anything else to tell you about this guy. Starts in two to three kicks. The first one, the way these guys work, just turns on the electronics. Uh, one thing that you guys may be interested to know is that these fuel injected bikes have a choke. Let's see if I can find it right here. Choke's right here. It's kind of hard to see, but that's the choke. The KFX also has one. I don't think the guy I got the bike from even knew that it had a choke. This one's probably easier to see. Nope, I was wrong, but there it is right there. That little silver guy is the choke. So I just wanted to take a quick video, test out the camera, and uh, give you a little update about what's going on with the toys really haven't been working on the turd i know that most of you guys are probably here to watch 455 g body stuff but i have lots of toys and that kind of was just a i got it almost for free so I, I work on it when i work on it it's not really my main interest all right guys well if there's any questions you have Feel free to comment. Oh, I don't think I showed you guys this either. 
I did get a new Fat Bar Crash Pad. Limited edition. It came in a two pack. This is the other one. But Murka, cause duh. So, just wanna take a quick video, show you what I got going on. I guess I can show you this stuff real quick. So this is the original seat cover for the KX450F. Those are the original fork springs and the original uh, rear fender in 2000. You know what? That bike's it's a two. That bike's a 2011. I said it wrong. It's a 2011 because in 2012 they uh, put on a white rear fender. So he put on a white rear fender to make it a 2012, essentially. This is kind of cool. He bought it from Grapevine in Dallas, and he was a uh, kind of like a factory racer for them. But anyway, if there's anything you guys want to see more of, if there's any questions you have, I'd be glad to make a video on anything. Uh, just let me know. Feel free to leave a kite, a like, a comment. Subscribe if you want. And I will catch you guys next time.